Hi Pittsburgh, I'm Molly Hanna Lang with Howard Hanna Real Estate Services. Welcome to 1415 Squirrel Hill Avenue, a great house in Murdoch Farms. And I should know, because it's my house. Come on in. Our kitchen originally, when we bought the house, was in the back of the house. It was dark, there wasn't a lot of light coming in, and so the number one thing I wanted was lots of light in this Pittsburgh house. The second thing in the layout design that I was really, really focused on was having the kitchen have an entertaining space in it. I didn't want a wall blocking me and my children, or my, me and my guests. This peacock blue was a real obvious choice, but we kept it just as the peninsula, or island, as other people would call it. So it gives a pop of color, but it's not overwhelming, and we still keep the white in. The hood was really important. I wanted it to be a statement piece. Another piece of this kitchen that was I did not realize that I would love as much as I do is looking out onto the street but also looking out onto my porch. I didn't realize that my children would be using this porch for so much activity. And I can do the things that moms do. I'm able to watch my children while I'm doing that. So what we wanted to do was really create this warm, welcoming living area connected to the kitchen. One of the things that we didn't realize at the time was that the fireplace does work. But this fireplace, it does work and it is gas. So the minute it turns cold, that fireplace is turned on. This is where my family spends the majority of our time. And I wanted to feel warm and youthful and happy. We decided we did need more space. So what we did was we created this butler's pantry off of it. The second dishwasher, which is a luxury to say the least, but it also pretty much saved my sanity during quarantine. I also have a second oven in here. That was a really thought out plan. I think that that's important, especially for holidays, to have more than one oven. This is my bribe area. Our bar is the center, truly, of the house. We did the black lacquer. We have different fixtures than we do in the kitchen or the pantry, but in here you have your wine bar. You also have a great ice machine, which actually means a lot to a person who likes to make a cocktail. This is the living room. Um, this room is really like my sanctuary. I do love that it is white and bright. We did this kind of band around the room, and this is paint. It just gives it something a little bit more depth and a little bit more interest. In this house, we have three fireplaces. So we use this in the winter when we are in this room, and if it's not too hot, we turn on the fireplace. My husband's like started this kind of vintage -y record collection. Then the record is also connected to our entire Sono system. One person can be upstairs listening and one person can be down here changing the tunes. The house has six bedrooms. It's great because it gives a lot of space and you can make guest rooms. You can have a gym in one of the bath or bedrooms like we do. Um, you can make an office space, which everybody wants right now. The primary area is very enclosed, so it feels like you're off from the rest of the house. Each of the bedrooms is a great size. Each bedroom also has a fireplace, not working, but fireplaces because this house was built in 1912, so the fireplaces are part of the architectural charm. When we bought this house seven years ago, I really didn't want like a grassy big backyard. Grass is just another thing to take care of. Even though we have little kids, I was like, this is better. They can ride their bikes. They can rollerblade back here. They can do all sorts of things. If you want to go to the park, it's down the street. We have our grill. We have like a great seating area. This is another table that we really use. The tree house is really like a kids only kind of zone. It's just adding like the whimsy and fun, just something to just give it a little bit more kid friendly vibe. I have been a Pittsburgher my whole life, but I never really knew about Squirrel Hill Avenue. And I was like, what is this? It's so quaint, it's so cute, and it's quiet. There's these like really cool brick arches that lead into the house, and then this porch. It's a water feature we have here. Um, the water feature came with a koi. 
it really does, people walk by all the time and they're like, oh, I love hearing the twinkling, the tinkling of the pond. This street is really special. It is flat here. You know, kids are playing hockey here. This is literally where everybody learns how to ride a bike because it's so quiet and there's no cars coming down. Thanks guys for coming and touring 1415 Squirrel Hill Avenue with me. I hope you had a little bit of fun um, and liked some of my stories. Uh, if you're interested in this house, I would love nothing more than to sell it to you. I'm Molly Hannah Lang with Howard Hannah Real Estate. See you on the flip side.